everybody. Welcome into our Studio 10 kitchen. Alongside Chef Nino, you've got something on display. Oh man, this is our Rouse's Vidalia Fresh Onions, Fresh Vidalia Onion Sausage. <laughs> All right, so a, a newer product, and you mentioned Vidalia onions only come around a certain time of year. We're in the peak season right now, arguably the world's sweetest onion, grown only in Vidalia, Georgia. That's right. So it's kind of like the Marzano, the San Marzano tomatoes of Italy. That's right. That's right. Often imitated, never duplicated. That's right. They grow San Marzano in California, but they don't have the same soil with the volcanic ash in San Marzano by Mount Vesuvius. It could be a totally different flavor. Also, it's highly illegal to call something Vidalia if it ain't from Vidalia, Georgia. Oh, really? You and your family are going to jail. Oh, okay. Well, let's not don't do that. Don't mess with Vidalia onions, bro. And you've got some in here right now. What are we making? Oh today with these. Nina. I'm going to do a Carolina mustard sauce uh, with our fresh sausage made with Vidalia onions. It is absolutely phenomenal. You want to you want this recipe all right. So let's talk to the folks about, so hey, we're very um, region specific. Vidalia, Georgia, Carolina mustard. What's a Carolina mustard sauce? All right. It's going to be kind of tangy, sweet and sour. You got the mustard and the vinegar, but really downplayed with the honey and the brown sugar. Oh, okay. So you have a little bit of uh, sweet heat, a little bit of tangy, a little bit of sweet, and it's really a nice combination. Sounds like a flavor explosion in the mouth. It, I like that. Yeah. Wow. How about it's that? It's almost like a kaleidoscope. Oh. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And if you, we should do a special effect on the screen right now where it turns all the kaleidoscope yeah, stuff. Yeah, like a, like a light refractation with a, through a prismatic lens reaching the inner depth of the olfactory nerves so the smells create a, an experience. <laughs> Wow! I just had an experience just <laughs> listening to that. All right, so we've got these going right now. When we come back, we're going to start to mix all this stuff. We're going to start to mix. I want to get these nice and brown. Okay. All right, and uh, not too brown, but I want them. I don't want to be crunching on some onions in that sauce. You know what I'm saying? So give it about five minutes stirring. And we did use a little bit of Rouse's olive oil in the Vidalia. When we come back, we're just going to assemble it, let it simmer for about 20 minutes, and it's done. Carolina mustard, put uh, empty out and wash a, a mayonnaise jar or a mason jar, and you have it for a week in the refrigerator. There you go. Stick around. We'll be right back with Chef Nino to show you how to make this. We are making a something we've never done before on Studio 10. Tell the folks what it is. This is a know? Carolina mustard sauce. Carolina mustard sauce. All right, sounds Unlike good. any sauce you've ever had. And it's a little bit sweeter with these Vidalia onions we're mm. using today and the Vidalia sausage. Mm, mm, mm. So, so glad you could join us. Is the basic concept here, Nino, if you're having a, a cookout, a grill out or something, and you can make this and you can dip your meats into it? Yeah. Okay. Uh, it works good with sausage chicken, steak, whatever. Okay, all right. Even on a nice big old ham sandwich, that Carolina oh, mustard sauce. Oh, yeah, I could see that. Slather it on. Slather it up. Sla <laughs> we don't say that often enough. <laughs> Suffer so and suck attack. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so what do we need? We got the onions going in the Rouse's olive oil. What's yeah. the next step? Okay, we those are nice and uh, translucent, kind of wilted a little bit. All right, now we're going to put in our honey, mm -hmm. all right? Uh, and uh, it calls for a quarter cup. You can put a half a cup. And uh, I love the Rouse's honey because it's locally sourced uh, and it's actually made from Louis Louisiana bees. It, it says that right there. Yeah. And yeah. we check them too. <laughs> you do? <laughs> All right. Good Trust stuff me. there. All so, right. <laughs> so we've got our Rouse's olive oil, our Rouse's honey. That's right. Okay. All right. Now we get our Rouse's mustard. How about that? Look at that. Just, uh, just regular old yellow mustard. Yeah. And, uh, I'm going to show you how to cut the mustard on TV. <laughs> Don't ever say I can't cut the mustard, okay? <laughs> All right. And uh, here it calls for two cups of mustard, and that's two cups right in here. Yeah. And I, I have my heat off because if you assemble all of these things while you have the heat and it's going to just splatter mm. while you slather <laughs> you just spatter this segment brought to you by the letter s we yeah. are very alliterative today that's right yes 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 okay all right and now uh, we're going to put a half a cup of vinegar 
All right. And uh, I know y'all thinking, how does Chef memorize all that? I'm gifted with brilliance and markers. <laughs> There's the line. <laughs> Can't go That's past right. the line. And that is Rouse's vinegar, too. So Rouse has of a lot of their own products for all this sort of stuff. So now check this out. You have the vinegar and the mustard really pungent sour okay but to offset that we put in the honey and we're gonna put in about a cup of brown sugar nice okay now believe it or not you need some celery seed in there one teaspoon of celery you wrote seed. it on there yes that's right really this is a unifier you're not gonna know it's in there but this is gonna add that Carolina flavor to Ooh, it all wow. right now uh, we need a quarter cup of lemon juice. Okay. Rouse's brings this from Sicily. I'm just along for the ride today. That's right, brother. Sicilian lemon juice. Nice. Quarter cup. All right. Some acidity to it. Yes, sir. All right. Now, so it calls for salt and pepper. Sicilian acidity. Sicilian acidity. It's a tongue twister. It is. Yep. Boy, you're just slathering the <laughs> spatter. <laughs> All right. And uh, it doesn't call for it, but I'm going to put some Rouse's Creole seasoning instead of just salt and pepper. Now, be careful. This is some good Creole hot uh, seasoning right here. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to care. <coughs> good Lord. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm going to... Uh, Go to the hospital. That's right. And when, when and we, we come, come back. Then we yeah. come back, no, we're going to finish it up. Yeah, what I want to do, I want the heat to come up gradually. <laughs> when it comes to a boil, I want to let it simmer for about 20, 30 minutes until it's the thickness of the salt of a sauce. Okay? Now it's going to be kind of soupy. You don't want that. And you want all the flavors to really come together. You don't want to miss this recipe. Stick around. We'll be right back with Chef Nino. Carolina mustard sauce along with Chef Nino. Sweet, sour, tangy, in no way to describe, you gotta taste it. Taste the rainbow. I think that's the Skittles logo, but it applies here in a different way. Stay in your lane, brother. All right. All right. <laughs> we we went ahead and cooked our Rouse's fresh Vidalia onion sausage. Um, we put it in the oven for 350 for about 40 minutes. It'd even be better on the grill. Yeah, man. I love grilled sausages. I do too. And I love the uh, hardwood lump charcoal experience okay. on the on the grill. Explain why. Um, because did you know Henry Ford invented the briquette? I did not know that. His cars are made out of wood. The, the bumpers, the chassis, everything was wood pretty much. Okay. So he had piles of wood. So he burned it, the others ground it up, put filler, and the King's Ford charcoal came to be. How In every that? Ford dealership, they would have King's Ford charcoal bags and grills at every dealership. Thanks, Henry Ford. Yes, I know. Yeah. But unfortunately, they have to put little fillers in there. And a purist griller, griller like myself and many of you, uh, you want hardwood lump charcoal. Okay. All right. They just take oak, burn it down, and right before it pulverizes, they hose it down, and it's hardwood burnt. And that's your charcoal. And with the gas prices right now, too, you can put that in your F-150, and it works the same way, too. That's right. That's right. <laughs> Just light it up. Light it up. Gas is so high, I had to sell my car to get gas money. Man, I'm sorry to hear that. <laughs> yeah, well, you yeah. know. All right. So, Carolina mustard sauce <laughs> on route. Uh, on a route. Yeah, don't stand <laughs> right over the pot there, pungent, brother. Huh? This sounds potent. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Huh. It'll get you. Yes, sir. All right. Ooh, yeah. Look at that. There we are. Now I want you to try that, uh, my brother. Carolina mustard sauce with Rouse's fresh Vidalia onion sausage. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. All right. And we're getting closer to those summer months and we're talking about grilling out. And if you're getting ready for a party or a grilling session or whatever, you got to go check out Rouse's, right? This is good on steak, pork, seafood, mm. ham, and anything. Mm-hmm. You understand what I'm saying? Sweet sour, salty, spicy. It's just amazing. Contrast. What was the last word? Contrast. There you go. 
all the flavors coming together is so good, man. This mm -hmm. is the best. See, see, when I first started about three, four years ago with Joe, yeah, I have improved my vocabulary <laughs> enunciation. He, every other word, huh? What? What he say? What he said? Now it's very rare he has mm. to say that, you know. And hey, I know you a grilling person. Mm -hmm. That Carolina muscle is easy to make. Make enough for seven days in your uh, mayonnaise jar or mason jar. I'm gonna do that. This is fantastic, y'all. Gotta try the recipe, especially with summer right around the corner. Mm. Chef Nino, thanks a lot, man. This is delicious. Yeah, and get your Vidalia onions, the Vidalia onion sausage, uh, while you can. It's soon gonna be over. Season's gonna be over real soon. All right, we gotta go because I'm just eating now. This is eating time. I can tell what we need. He likes it whenever he he, <laughs> he, he continues eating. Yes, yes, yes. All right.